Merry Christmas, everybody. I just want to say, this is, uh, this is, uh, Santa Claus here saying, Merry Camo Christmas to everybody. Merry Camo Christmas to everybody. Hey, everybody. Good morning. It's Christmas Day. Just thought I'd do a quick live stream this morning. I was going to uh, just do a video this morning and show all the Christmas cards I got from you fine folks, but I would have to hold the camera, or put it on a tripod or something because I want to use both hands. So I just thought I would do a quick live stream so I could do the camera, so I can show the camera, show the camera here. So I just want to go through this pile of cards I got and uh, I want to shout out everybody who sent me some of these nice cards. I really, 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 really appreciate it. Look at this. Isn't this nice? Anyway, I just want to shout them out and uh, say hi to everybody. And uh, yeah, and I also mailed out to a bunch of people uh, the Camo Dave and Crotchy Christmas card. So uh, if you're on the uh, if you're on the preferred list, you got one of these this year. I we don't have a whole lot of these. Mister Rockford in Chicago made them up for me, uh, and uh, a really nice picture here. Uh, yeah, Barb took these pictures, uh, what was it, last year, and then we, we had the Camo Dave Christmas card from last year, and then I, I went through the pictures, and this was a really nice shot, so uh, so anyway, uh, Rockford made these up for me, and I really appreciate that, so these, you should have gotten one of these in the mail, or you will very soon, hey, Shamay, good morning, I won't say you're my favorite moderator, because that'll make all my other mods mad, but uh, you, know, you know what I mean, anyway, Jeremy, good morning, I don't want to take up your time, I know you're well, you know, most of you guys are probably adults and you probably like, you know, getting up early and wait, wait. You know, when we were kids, my dad was very stern about this. We opened up our presents Christmas morning. You did not, you know, some of the, a lot of people like to open up the presents like right after midnight when it becomes Christmas. And dad was very stern about, no, we open up our presents Christmas morning. So uh, that's what we did. And uh, so, yeah, so you're probably, if you've got kids around, you're probably opening up the presents right now. But I, there's no requirement that you watch this live. I just wanted to do it because it's easier for me to use both of my hands and show you all the wonderful cards we got. So uh, that's what we're doing. Mm. It was a very rainy Christmas Eve here in uh, Morganton, North Carolina. It's unstoppable Morganton. And this morning it is uh, cold, uh, 29 degrees, but a 15 mile an hour wind. The wind chill is like 15 degrees. So anyway, Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas to all the early risers. When we were kids, yeah, we would get up about 6 a.m. on Christmas morning and we'd sneak out and see all the presents under the tree. And there was one Christmas we had a snowstorm in New Jersey. And uh, my dad was, he worked, he was the uh, head of the Sunday school department at the local Presbyterian church. And he felt the need to uh, get up to the church and uh, make some phone calls or whatever and tell everybody that church was canceled. So he couldn't get his car out because we had about a foot of snow. So he walked up to the church on this was Christmas morning on a Sunday and uh, had to tell everybody that the uh, church was. Had to, I don't know why he couldn't do it from home because we had a telephone at home. But I guess the phone numbers were up at the church. He had to call everybody and tell them there was not going to be church that day or Sunday school. But, you know, how are they going to get there was a foot of snow on the, on the ground. So anyway, um, he and mom said we could not open our presents until dad got back. So dad had to walk like two miles to the church, spend the morning there calling people, come back two miles, and then we could open our presents. So we didn't get to open our presents till like two in the afternoon. And we were really, my sister and I were really like, we were dying. We were like looking at this pile of presents. <laughs> and then there was one Christmas where my pres my parents ordered presents. Um, they didn't have online back then, but they ordered all their stuff, I think, from Sears. This was in the 60s. And nothing came. The, the, the pile of presents just didn't get delivered. So they went out on Christmas Eve and bought us a whole bunch of presents. And then late that evening or something, all the presents came. So we had double the presents. We had, you know, mom and dad just figured out oh, what the heck. <laughs> Merry Christmas, Omaha, Omaha, Jeremy Shearer. Uh, yeah. All right. I'm going to do some shout outs here to uh, some of the, uh, to all of the cards. I, to all the people that sent me these wonderful cards. I, I'm not going to dox anybody. Okay. Just make sure your addresses are not in here. But uh, RV and Church. And it's a, uh, AKA, and it looks like I can't read it. It's so little. Reek, pick. Anyway, RV and church. Beck. Beck. Looks like Beck. Have a, hope you have a good 2021. Uh, yeah, yeah. Anyway, 
uh, and a couple of bucks thrown in here. So RV and Church, thank you so much for this wonderful card. I do appreciate it. It was Mr. Rockford here. Oh, I have to punch up the alternate chat. He's in the alternate universe. I can't. <laughs> Mr. Rockford's in the alternate universe. Yeah, again, I was, sh I was shouting out the wonderful card you said. I'm, I'm going to make this uh, publicly available now. The Camo Dave and Crotchy Christmas card. Isn't that nice? And uh, Barb took the picture, and uh, that was uh, last year. We She took a, a really nice photo shoot of a whole bunch of cool pictures of me and Crotchy. And then we did a Christmas card for last year. So uh, that was our that was what we did. And uh, I picked out that shot out because I thought it looked really nice. Yeah, Merry Christmas, Go Frugal. How you doing? I just thought I'd come on here and do a little live stream and catch up on uh, some of the, the cards we got here. Uh, I found one present under the tree, and that was this. So uh, that's okay. That will be my Christmas cheer this afternoon and this evening. So anyway, Merry Christmas for you to travel and Bounder Roads <coughs> and Polly Petal. Merry Christmas. The other thing I got, I'll show you. Other than, you know, I did get the uh, – this wasn't really a Christmas present, but my friend Michael sent me the uh, bus there, the Lego bus, which I still haven't started putting together, but I will do that on the first su su sunny, snowy day here in North Carolina. I also got this in the mail. Uh, I, this is a sponsorship thing, but I consider this a Christmas present because it was free, but it's a little, uh, little. Uh, you put this on like uh, like the back of your car and then you can you you can have a, install a backup camera on your car and you do not need to do any special wiring. So I'm going to be doing a review of this sucker. So this is my Christmas present. So I'll be working on that. Thank you uh, to the wonderful company in uh, Hong Kong that sent that to me. <laughs> Merry Christmas to all in the chat. Hey, free to travel. Noreen, Merry Christmas, Noreen. I got Noreen's Christmas... Where's Noreen's card in here? I'll get to Noreen's card in just a – I know it's in here. We'll get to it in time. This is a nice little card here. Thank you so much to AB Roadrunner uh, from one of your subscribers. Uh, oh, he also sent me an Arizona map. Thank you. I got a laminated map from uh, Ether Bunny, Bubba Warbucks, and now I got a paper map. So when I go to Arizona sometime in early 2021, and I want to do that. There's a nice guy in uh, Gilbert, Arizona, who has said I can stay at his place for a couple weeks uh, rent free. So I'm, I really want to do that when uh, things settle down in the V department and we'll be doing that. So thank you very much, AB Roadrunner. This is I don't want to do any favorites, but I think this really has a nice, uh, you know, with the channel I run with the nomads. I really like this card. This is a nice card. It has, has such a nomadic theme. There is no place like home for the holidays. Merry Christmas, Dave. And again, I can't. Phil and Judy, Phil and Judy, Phil and Judy's Tab Blue Adventures on Facebook. Phil and Judy, this is a wonderful card. There's no place like home for the holidays. Yeah, there's a lot of, a lot of people living in their trailers and RVs. All right. Anyway, thank you to uh, BJ Smith, where the Mississippi flows from east to west. Wow. Where is where does the Mississippi flow from east to west? Wherever that is, that's where BJ Smith is. Thank you so much for this card. It's so nice. Ho, ho, go. Geico, 1975. Oh, Jeremy, how you doing? Isn't that a nice card? Now, this was sent from Mr. Rockford. No, it wasn't. This was sent for Mr. I get my R's mixed up. Mr. Rod Sturgis up there in New Jersey, RS. I doxed him, didn't I? He's he's my he's my favorite troll. <laughs> anyway, this was his card. I uh, no comment on it. It's a very nice card. It's, it's Santa. It's Santa Claus. That's right. Santa Claus comes in all flavors. So there he is, Mr. Santa Claus. And uh, it says, enjoy the booze and the snacks. And he also sent me a huge pile of those uh, little bagged, you know, potato chips and pretzels and cool stuff. So I got enough of those to last me at least uh, till inauguration, okay? <clears throat> I presume we're going to be having inauguration day. We, you never know. We, you know, we may have a martial law by then. I have no idea. Uh, I got the, oh, man, these, this is all falling apart here. Santa knows you're naughty or nice. 
Uh, but it looks like he left something for you anyway. There's a little thing for a gift card here, but there was no gift card in it, but there was a couple of bucks. Uh, thank you. Merry Christmas, Marie RV Camp Her. And she sends us a picture of not only her vehicle there, her vehicles. Isn't that neat? And I, I guess she wouldn't mind, you know. There's her, there's, there's she, Marie. Marie, thank you so much, Marie. That is a wonderful card, and I appreciate the sentiment very much. A lot of places, uh, the Mississippi, yeah, yeah, there's a lot of places. The Mississippi River curls and sometimes goes north. Yeah, if you, it's a one, it's an old man we are meandering river. And yeah, it doesn't just flow straight south. It goes, so yeah, there's places where it goes north. Oh, yeah. Anyway, oh, isn't this a nice one? The Boides, the Boides. Uh, this is hard to read because it's like writing on top of the picture there. Sue Kelly. Oh, Sue Kelly. Thank you, Sue Kelly. I appreciate that. It's a beautiful card. I love it. I love it. I don't know. <laughs> Tasmod. Tasmod, Portland, Oregon. Believe. Isn't that nice? Thank you, Tazzy. Taz has been on our chats here a lot. It's probably a little early for him there in Oregon since it is only 5 a.m. I know I'm doing this early, but anyway, I thought I, again, I thought I'd do it on the live chat because it's just so easy because it's hard for me to have the camera and, and yeah, it's just easier for me to do this. So anyway, it's just saying happy, happy, more, Merry Christmas. I've got, you can't see that in the, the lights back there. You can't really, can you? Huh? I, I got the green and red lights up there. It doesn't really show, does it? Let's turn this off. Can, does that show now? It's hard to see that. You know, this is a green light and this is a red light. I don't know. This goofy little camera here doesn't show all the colors, but uh, those are the colors. Uh, Michael and Bella's Travel Channel. Merry Christmas. Stay safe and strong. Safe chat travels. Uh, yeah, we want to. We want to wish everybody safe travels out there. It's a crazy year and there's a lot of uh, the V going around. And I'm. I'm. I'm I, so far, so good. So far. We have seen, uh, let's see, the green lights. I got the, I got the red light to prove it here, yeah. So anyway, uh, we, we really hope everybody's safe this year. You want to, Safety is an important thing, you know. I like that card. He has a nice card. Uh, this, is from, uh, this is from Mr. Rockford. Mr. Rockford sent me this. And again, Mr. Rockford's the one who uh, designed or helped uh, laminate all these cards here. Thank you. Wishing you a joyous holiday season. Thanks for all the laughs. Merry Christmas, Bill. That's his name. I doxed him. <laughs> Bill Rockford. It's not James Rockford. This is my good friend Sandy. If you ever, if you remember watching my videos from uh, 2017 when I was in Rehoboth Beach when I met Adam the Boo, when we went to the Troll Diner there in Lewis, Delaware, I was staying at Sandy's place. And uh, yeah, Sandy got to meet Adam the Woo too. <laughs> so Sandy in Delaware, thank you so much. Uh, she used to be my neighbor there in Reston, Virginia. Very nice lady. And uh, she's still living there and everything's good. So uh, yes, yeah, Sandy in Delaware. I know many, many Sandys. So happy, happy holidays, Sandy in Delaware. Uh, this is from Kenny in Rockville. Looks like Rockville or Park. I love. It's hard to say. It looks like Rockville, Maryland. Okay, I used to hang out in Rockville when I was uh, with my uh, with my housemate last year when he was having his. You know what? I was spent a lot of time in Rockville. So anyway, hey John, how you doing? Yeah, I was saying. Uh, yeah, well, you know, <laughs> I may be going to Phoenix next year. So uh, yeah, so I was just mentioning that. So thank you very much, uh, Kenny. There, and I got a gift card here. I already spent this twenty bucks at Walmart. Thank you so much. I want to also thank all the folks. Uh, every now and then, everybody, somebody slipped in a couple of bucks in these cards, and I do appreciate it. Merry Christmas from me and Pip. Hoping the year ahead is a good one for you. This is uh, what's that? Twenty twenty. Dave, Merry Christmas from me and Pip. Okay, me. There's me and Pip. <laughs> Thank you, XOXO. And uh, this is a little more serious card here. Betty Smith in uh, beautiful uh, Minnesota, where there's, there's lots and lots of snow and cold this year. Anyway, but you know, I'm sure her house is nice and warm. Betty Smith. That isn't really her name. 
I don't even know what her real name is. She's very careful not to let me know, and I, it's okay. But uh, she sends me a card every month with a couple bucks sent in. I really appreciate it. And this was a beautiful card she sent. Uh, Merry Christmas and Happy New Year. Hope you stay safe and healthy. And so, he always sends me some beverage money. Well, <laughs> I, could, I could go use that money and buy another bottle of this, right? So anyway, thank you, Betty. Thank you so much. I want to thank. I want to thank. Oh, man, this is a glorious life on wheels. It looks like Carol. I'm a huge fan and enjoy your updates in the nomadic community. Uh, it, it, she doesn't really understand the dust stuff by you know who, that lady we don't talk about. Oh, dear. <laughs> Yeah, with someone who doesn't let their personal info discussed, they sure shouldn't put it all in a public platform. <laughs> uh, oh, she does a van life cooking channel. Wow. All right, we'll have to check it out, Carol. Glorious life on wheels and her van life cooking channel. All right, thank you so much for that lovely card. I must wet my whistle here. I am. I usually am uncovered on the heating pads, but when I start to feel stuffy, I cover up the electric blanket. Wow! I'm going to. Yeah, I, I hate that when you. <coughs> I don't use a heating. I don't use heating pads or a electric blanket. I just have a bunch of blankets. Um, Ellen up. Ellen in Nampanana up there in uh, Idaho made me a wonderful uh, camo blanket. Uh, I got one that Barb gave me. And then I've got, uh, you know, I just like to just, I don't sleep under the covers either. I don't like that. I like to sleep on top of the bed, but then just get a whole bunch of blankets. Hey, Daniel Sundstrom. Yeah, alcohol on Christmas. Hey, Stingray 75, Cochise 187. A lot of sales. Uh, yeah, I bet you the liquor stores were very close, very, uh, very uh, busy yesterday because I'm pretty much sure every liquor store in the country is closed today. Stingray75, thank you so much. He was the guy who sent me that big box of Yorkshire tea. I, 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 I'm, fin I'm at the very last couple bags of that. I did find some PG tips, though, at the Walmart. So I got another. So I, I'm ready. If, when I run out of the Yorkshire tea, I have PG tips all ready to go. So, uh, so yeah, I got to have my British breakfast tea in the morning or else I am, a, I am in a bad mood. John Sweet is waiting for the sun to come up. <laughs> yeah, yeah so i know it it's 5 20 well you know it's 6 20 where he is because that's uh, arizona frank costello one of my good buddies there he's been he's battling cancer for a long 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 time you know like 15 years and it's just you know but he's a sweet soul and a wonderful man and uh, we chat at least once a week and he's up there in utica new york and just a a, a truly Beautiful human being, and I want to shout out to him in this wonderful card. Uh, I always enjoy talking to Frank. Frank Costello, I, I love you, Frank. I really do. Uh, oh, 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 here it is. Here it is. Here's Noreen, one of our star moderators, and the uh, postcard she sent me. She loves Disney. You know, she's that's okay. I'm not against anybody that loves Disney. She likes to go down to Orlando and hang out there, and this is, uh, this is her. What is, who's that, Goofy? <laughs> don't forget your mask merry christmas yeah my, my holiday mask all right thank you very much uh noreen uh i met noreen a couple times we uh we the doxinator and noreen had lunch there over at the troll diner south there in beautiful rock hill south carolina several times so she's in the charlotte area so she's not too i'm not doxing you her address is no She's not that far away from me, so, uh, but, you know, but we've been keeping socially distant because it's the thing to do. Brenda Stewart, thank you so much. Brenda, very nice card. I love it. Thank you so much, Brenda. I like to see, I, she's in the chat all the time. Uh, travels from Duda. Uh, Merry Christmas. Richmond, did you get any snow in Richmond? We just got cold rain here lately. It was actually a warm day yesterday. It rained all day. And then we got, uh, I think, I'm sure the mountains got some snow, but we didn't. It's uh, I just looked. It's a nice sunny day. It's cold, though. But uh, a lot of the Northeast got some snow last night with those with those big, crazy storms coming through. Uh, yeah, I usually, a bit, a bit, a bit, I'm reading I'm re things. Daniel Sendstrom, thank you. Uh, Stan W. Merry Christmas and Happy Holidays. 
you to go, Coach Cheese. Hey, Rick Pettycord, Nevada. It's early for you. Thank you, Brad. Brad's the NASCAR. The fam- we have some famous. Uh, <laughs> we have some famous uh, people that watch the channel, and Brad is a uh, famous NASCAR driver. So uh, thank you, Brad. Six inches in Boone. Oh, are you in Boone? Yeah, Boone's only an hour and change north of here. Literally an hour north of here. I was up in Boone with this with um, Barb last year. Beautiful town. We ate it that. There's a big hamburger joint. I forget the name of it, but it's some of the best burgers I've ever had there on that uh, 321 there. Really good burgers. I can't remember the name of it. It's just to the south of downtown. Boone is a beautiful little town. I tr- do, I've been up there a couple times doing some hiking over the past summer. Uh, Banner Elk, Boone, Grandfather Mountain. We were staying over there at uh, Sugar Mountain. That's a beautiful place up there. I, that's like heaven on earth up there, you know. The, uh, the the Blue Ridge Parkway and everything. Uh, but, yeah, we didn't get any rain here. I mean, we didn't get any snow here. We got rain. Yeah, no snow in Charlotte. Yeah, Charlotte's warmer than we are. So if we didn't get any snow, they didn't either. Anyway, so uh, save money. My down 300 kilo. Wow, you're saving some money there. Michael and Bella, thank you. Michael and Bella. Uh, travel channel. I'll have to check you out. Send me uh, camodavidgmx.com, your address there, and I will be happy to do that. Uh, I want to shout out to uh, Peggy and Zachary. Hang in there. It will get better. Thank you, Peggy and Zachary. I believe they're from uh, Georgia. I think so. I remember. I don't have the uh, the address. I mean, I don't have the envelope with me, but I, I think they're from Georgia. Thank you very much, Peggy and Zachary. Uh, going through the Christmas cards I got this year from all you wonderful people. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Isn't this a nice one? That's that's kind of a – I guess that's a Christmas card. I don't know. Uh, hey, Camo Dave and Crotchy. Closed is $11. 10 is for your Camo Dave, and, and $1 is for Crotchy. So a $1 for Crotchy. Uh, I put it in his pocket along with your hotline number. Should you ever get separated, he can – that's right. He has a dollar. Give a couple of quarters. You can use a pay phone. JW, Merry Christmas from the Martins in Mill, Martins Mill, Texas. Thank you. Merry Christmas, everybody. I, you know, I don't want to interrupt your uh, opening of your presents, but, uh, you know, we always, what we always did, my sister, I was going to hang, hang out at my sister's place in Manassas this year, but, you know, I just, with the whole crazy situation, I call it the situation. I just figured it'd be better just to kind of hunker down here. I'm going to be going up to Northern Virginia probably sometime in early 2021 because uh, I do have some family business to attend to. And uh, so I thought, ah, I'll be going up there in another couple months. So uh, I'll, I'll see everybody then. Christmas food. I got a Subway. I got a sub at uh, Walmart. That's my <laughs> sub at Walmart. I got some frozen pizzas. I'm the opposite of NASCAR. I slow roll the Prius V of five. Hey, go. Neil Young, Sugar Mountain. Yes, Sugar Mountain's a wonderful place. So it's a ski resort. I'm sure they got some skiers up there right now because I'm sure they, if Boone got snow, Sugar Mountain got a lot of snow. So Sugar Mountain's up a little higher, right? So anyway, they're probably skiing up there this weekend. Christmas skiing, yeah. You don't get a white Christmas. I've lived in the mid-Atlantic. You know, I lived in New Jersey and Virginia almost all my life. One of the two places near you know, Washington, D.C., near Philadelphia. And I can remember maybe five white Christmases out of my whole life. You know, very rare to get a white Christmas in you know Philadelphia or D.C. But you do get them every now and then. Merry, Merry Christmas, everybody. Roland Orza Balls. Hey, you did a great job counting the votes in the Cami Awards. That's a joke. I know some people don't get my humor. Hey, Lori's Way. Merry Christmas. You're up early. People are getting up early there in Courtside. Are you still in Courtside? Patty White. Yeah, I'm just uh, doing the uh, Christmas card list here. Uh, this is a nice card. Look at that. Santa Claus. There's Bob Wells. I didn't get a card from Bob Wells this year. Brian Heffernan. That's right. Brian Heffernan, my good buddy there in uh, Columbus, Ohio. So thank you, Brian. He keeps an eye on, uh, he keeps an eye on Stormy's Twitch feed for me. (laughs) And Stormy does anything in her Twitch feed. I hear about it. 
Yeah, they made snow too. They make snow there too, right? <coughs> Please, everybody, smash the like button. That's right. Smash the like button. Smash it. Uh, w2, w, I made, actually, people, some people aren't going to believe this. I made the, the nice list. <laughs> to Dave, Santa must be slipping. Happy Christmas and Happy New Year. You're under, oh, this is just from my underground army. Underground army. Yeah. If you want to, if you, you want to camo Dave, uh, we still have a bunch of these left. Rockford sent me a whole pile of them. Uh, new ones. Uh, if you want to join the Camo Dave Army, just to send me an email, Camo Dave at, or set, yeah, Camo Dave at gmx.com and let me know your address, okay? Let me know your address and I'll mail you one of these. Camo Dave News Army official special agent. It's just to report news and you know, watch other people's Patreons and tell me what they're doing. Yeah. Oh no, <laughs> my Patreon is secret. Arg, <laughs> arg, I'm a pirate. Arg. <laughs> anyway, aloha, Mike. How are you doing? Is that coming or going? Merry Orza Balls. Merry Orza Balls, everybody. <laughs> Rick Williams, nice to see you here. What present? It's just me and Melissa. What better present could I ask for? Zero drama and COVID. And then no COVID. Yes. We don't want that. No. No COVID, Grammy. Yeah, no COVID. Right. I've got COVID. <laughs> Merry Christmas. I've got no. I don't. I don't. And I wish it on nobody. Nice card here. Peace on Earth. A peaceful Earth today. Yes. Uh, nice, nice note here from Sam. I hope this card finds you and your and, and well. Uh, the static. Yeah, we get uh, the static nomads. We stumbled upon your channel. We just wanted to let you know, uh, thank you for all you do. Your awesome channel. Yeah. Uh, oh, we, uh, near, nearby Charlotte. Uh, yeah. Okay. Okay. Well, very nice. We still are laughing at the fact that you called Panda's Land COVID Acres. Oh, that's very nice. Carrie, Carrie and Sam. Carrie and Sam, thank you so much for this card. It's very nice. Do, 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 do. Mike and Nicole living life. Merry Christmas from Quebec. I bet you got some snow up there. <laughs> That's Canada. Yeah. Is there any? I guess got, I mean, even Vancouver got some snow a little while ago, right? Uh, so, yeah. Anyway, I sent these cards out. These are really nice. Uh, thank you to Rockford for putting these together. Uh, Barb took the photograph last year and uh, took a whole bunch of cool pictures. So, I. Just and anyway, it just was going through them and this is a nice shot. So anyway, so anyway, uh, yeah. and we only got a couple more of these left. I still have a few left. If you want one, let me know. CamoDavidGMX.com for the Christmas cards. I only got a couple more of these left, so uh, I'll mail those out uh, if you want one. CamoDavidGMX.com if you want a Christmas card or a uh, Camo Dave News Army card. These are in real short supply, but I have a whole bunch of these left. So, so. Uh, oh gosh, a Texas Christmas, a Texas Christmas from, uh, and again, it's hard to read that signature. It looks like Sydney. It looks like Shirley or si it looks like Sydney wishing you a merry, very merry Christmas. Maybe this is Papa Texas, Sydney. Do we dox him? I hope not. Anyway. Thank you very much, Sydney. I, I don't know who that is. I mean, I, but, you know, if it is Papa Texas or if it isn't, I want to wish a Merry Christmas to Papa Texas, too, because he sent me a very nice uh, message on one of my chats there or whatever. No, I'm, I'm 17B. Thank you so much. A very Merry Christmas to you. We got a nice uh, card from uh, – oh, okay, the card – okay. I'm going to have to run and get I, – I got the card that I'm 17B sent me. It's a 3D Christmas uh, – um, I'll have to run out and get that. I'll go get it. Hold on. I left it out. It's, over, it's under the tree. It's under the tree. Obviously, 
shut the door. I believe this is Ad 7 TV sent me this one, right? This is a nice one. Isn't that neat? And a little bit of cash along with that. Thank you so much, Odd 17 Beer. We put this one under the tree. It just looks so nice there. Also, this was a Rod Stir just sent me this. It's like a little sippy cup. I guess I could put some Tito's vodka in it and uh, drink it through the little sippy cup. So isn't that nice? It's a little Bob Wells head. And then my sister got me this last year for Christmas. Missed the family this year, but I'll be seeing them sometime soon. Uh, this was always really nice. They sold these, I think, at Hobby Lobby. Anyway, uh, they had like, the I don't know if they did them this year or not, because there's not a Hobby Lobby right around here. But this was like the retro Christmas. They had a whole bunch of retro Christmas uh, ornament -y things. And this was one of them. And I, I, I know, you know, I'm, yeah, this is really neat. But it's a nice little trailer with a little wreath on it. So that is cool. That is so cool. <clears throat> I don't know. Did they sell those this year again at a uh, Hobby Lobby? Hey, smartphone 3.0 in a year without Christmas. Cheers. <clears throat> I did. I did. <laughs> Rockford was very generous. Okay. Let me just say that. Okay. But yeah, we did send out, I did send cards to all of the people I could think of that have been important, you know, to this channel over the years. And, uh, and uh, I probably left a few people out, but uh, yeah, if you haven't, you may still, you, I'm not saying everybody got theirs yet because the mail's kind of slow and they, some of these didn't get mailed out to earlier this week. So if you didn't get one, it may still come. East Tennessee, it's cold. Yeah, it's cold here too. I haven't bothered to go out. I actually wore long pants today too. It's, uh, wind chill is like 15 degrees. So I figured that's not shorts weather. Mark Fun Jones. I mean, Mark, I'll mail you one of these if you send me your address. I don't, I don't remember your address, MFJ. MFJ. He's, he's always been there for this channel, and I appreciate that. Rodney Shell, suspicious package left on your porch this morning. You called, <laughs> blew it up. It was only fruitcake. Well, well, maybe that you know. Sometimes those fruitcakes are really hard. You know, a little um, that might have softened it up a little bit. Mary Sanders, Merry Christmas to you. I appreciate all the love you have shown my channel over the past year. Oh, Betty, yeah, I, Betty, I just shouted out your uh, Christmas card there. You have to hit the rewind button. I think uh, <laughs> there it is, Betty Smith. I just shouted you out just a few minutes ago. Thank you so much, Betty. And she got oh, good. The mail made it. Her the mail made it to. Uh, Beautiful uh, Minnesota. I'm not important. Don't worry about me, Dave. That's why I got rid of the PO box. I thought that I, I was. I remember you saying something like that. So yeah, I, I could. I could just put. Uh, you know, I know. I know where you live, but I mean, I know. I could. I could. I, we, we have very good. Uh, the Camo Army is very good at doxing people. I'm just saying. So I could probably have one of my Camo Army people hand deliver it. <laughs> no, just don't want to scare anybody. <laughs> Mark Funnel Cake Jones. Always remember. I love you. Should have kept the funnel cake in your name. I, I like that. Remember, he he was making the funnel cake and he reached down and burned his hand and that. Then he did a live stream in the ambulance going to the hospital. I thought that that's yeah. We haven't seen too many people doing live streams while they're actually in the ambulance. That that is a high point of the bottom of YouTube. Uh, the, yeah, one of the great moments at the bottom of YouTube is. Uh, um, Mark Fun Jones live streaming from the ambulance with the, his hands all, you know, yeah, man, and the funnel cake, yeah, the, the infamous funnel cake. <laughs> I don't make another bird. Or, ordered turkey from a local BBQ place. Oh, I do have turkey lunch meat. I may make a turkey sandwich today. I do have a turkey. Oh, I bought a turkey sub at Walmart too. One of those turkey subs. So I got some. I got a lot of turkey today. I'm good. I'm covered. Rick Williams, you become one of our favorite YouTube channels informing us about van dwellers. Uh, we found Rosie through your channel, Rich Life Road Trips, as well as many others. Yeah, Rosie sent me a very nice PayPal donation the other day. I want to thank Rosie. I sent a very overly long letter in response and email. So I don't know. She's probably shocked at all the details I gave her. But uh, anyway, thank you very much. Look at this card. The nice little patriotic Christmas card there. Merry Christmas, uh, Docs. Oh, oh, oh. This is my Doxinator. My Doxinator. Doxinator. It's from uh, Doxy, Sue, Champ, and Jilly. 
Uh, and, he, and he sent me a couple bucks. So thank you, Dotsnader. I, I was hoping to get together with the Dotsnader more this year. But I did get together. You know, I'm only about an hour and a half away from him here in Morganton. And we did get together back at the end of January. And then the pandemic hit. And he's kind of hunkered down in his garage. You know, he's got some issues. And we don't want to put him in any uh, danger or anything. So I was hoping this summer we'd, I'd be hanging out there every couple weeks or months for a, a night or two. And we could do some live streams. Hopefully in early 20, or hopefully in 2021, we get back to doing that. I know you guys love seeing Doxinator in the, uh, the, the live streams. And do it from his kitchen and Jilly's running around and all that. So hopefully in 2021, we can get back to doing some of that. I really miss doing those things. I know, you know, you guys love, love when Doxy's in the videos. So I, I think he's probably still asleep this morning. He's sleeping in because I don't see him here. I'm making pot roast. Pot roast is good. Yeah, that's a good shit. That's a good. Uh, yeah, that's not, my family usually does that. Some sort of a, you know, roast, prime rib roast steak or something. I don't know. So I'll be missing that today, but I'm okay with that. <laughs> they always make a big breakfast too. My family they always have like a big eggy breakfast that you just pig out on the food all day. And by, you know, when the football games come on, you know, around one or two, you're like, oh, I, I need to stay lean and mean today. I need to go out and get a nice hike in, you know, I'll go over to the park today, bundle up and be, I'll see if I'll, you always see a few, uh, you know, We'll see some hikers over there in the park. What better way to spend Christmas than with camo, Dave? Overcoat, bird, the last time, still making potatoes. Man, I got to – man, Noreen, man, I could get over there in an hour and a half and we can have <laughs> – no, I'm just kidding. I might splurge and go out for Chinese food. Yeah, Chinese places are open. Uh, my friend and I, my friend and I that I'm, you know, staying with now, we, we've been friends for 35 years and uh, we used to spend Christmases together. My sister moved out west to Chico, California for many years. And so we didn't have any family Christmases. So there were a number of, of Christmases where my friend and I would go to a movie. The movie theaters back then were open on Christmas Day. And uh, there, was, there was usually a couple restaurants open. Uh, Clyde's uh, usually, I think, was open on Christmas Day. They're a real nice restaurant in the D.C. area. I don't know what they're doing now with the pandemic and all that. But Chinese places or Asian places were usually open on Christmas, yeah. Uh, this is from uh, my good buddy, Michael. He is, uh, he lives up in Reston, Virginia. I've done a couple live streams from his house there. He's actually staying in an assisted living place now, an apartment, but he may be moving back to the house pretty soon. They told him at the assisted living place not to smoke and he's been smoking. And so he may be getting kicked out. We're not sure yet. So he may be heading back to his beautiful house there in uh, Reston, Virginia. Uh, gotta, gonna need a little bit of fix up work. But uh, anyway, West Ham Fan TV, Legendary Pixel, Merry Christmas to you guys. Some pizza places. Yeah, I'm pretty sure Bucks downstairs is closed today, but some pizza places. I got I got plenty of frozen pizza. I got plenty of food in the fridge. I am not, I mean, I, I'm all stocked up. But anyway, this is from Michael. Thank you so much, Michael. Michael was the one who gave me the uh, Lego, the Lego, uh, the Lego uh, VW bus there. So I still got to take that out and put it together. Tango NV, Merry Christmas from Skip in Northern Nevada. Hey, the lonely, right near the lonely highway, right? Northern Nevada. We saw Dave's RV life traveling through there uh, just a couple of months ago, two months ago when he was going to get the Panda RV from Seattle. He went right up through Winnemucca, I think it was. Yeah, I'm looking at the map there. So that was that was pretty cool. I can't believe two of Chrome subscribers gave him two and three hundred dollar super chats. I don't know, Bob Outdoors. Chrome has done very well. You know, he does make a decent amount of money on uh, YouTube. And I don't know. You see these folks. All I used to see the trackers. I haven't watched Tim Tracker and his lovely wife in a while. They make a ton of money on YouTube. And they would do a live chat and people would throw them a ton of money. I, I guess they just want to get shouted out by the celebrity, you know. But, hey, you know. He does quality content. Uh, Chrome Advanced City Man Life has always done a wonderful channel. He's a nice guy. And, you know, people want to say thank you, and that's the way of doing it. And more power to everybody. So Merry Christmas, Chrome. I want to thank the Canadians. I, my favorite channels, Foresty Forest, Merry Christmas, Merry Christmas to Slim Potato, and Merry Christmas to Chrome. I, I you know, I, you know what, what, I could just what, – what channels? Well, who should I say Merry Christmas to? Lime Screw 1, Merry Christmas. Uh Van City Van Life. 
who else do I watch? I watched Just Incredible. I want to say Merry Christmas to uh, to James at Wonderlust Estate. I always enjoy his channel. Hope he gets a, a you know gets that used car fixed up and back on the road. Uh, Dogarn RV and Klerski the Creeper up there. Nampa Nana. Very happy Thanksgiving to her. She's been she sent me something in the mail and it still hasn't gotten here. I'm still waiting on a couple of uh, packages that still have not arrived. So hopefully uh, Saturday or Monday they'll come. Uh, this is from, oh, Tim, Teresa, and Jonathan from Youngstown, Ohio. They have been big supporters of my channel over the past year or two. Thank you so much for all your kind uh, support. And I want to send some love out to Ohio. A lot of my good buddies in Ohio, Brian Heffernan uh, and, uh, and Mr. Michael Nippert. He's a nice guy. He's over there in uh, over near Cincinnati. So I talk to Mike a lot. He's a Michael, Michael, Mike, Mr. N I just call him Nippy. New segment for Camo Dave, Legos with Dave. Yeah, I should, again, I thought, you know, I've done Legos when I was a kid. And the, this is really complicated. I was actually saving this because my uh, my nephew, uh, Tom in Northern Virginia there, uh, is really into Lego stuff. And I thought maybe I could take this up for Christmas and he could help me put it together. But that didn't quite veg this year. So uh, anyway, time to start waking everybody up. Have a great day. Oh, yeah, you got the kids, right? Mark's up before the kids are on Christmas morning, huh? Hey, kids, get up. <laughs> Don't we want to sleep in, Dad? Starbucks is open, really, on Christmas? I don't remember Starbucks being open. I remember we used to hang out at the Starbucks a lot, and I think they always closed on Christmas in Northern Virginia. But Merry Christmas. This is a nice card. Isn't that a nice card? That's a uh, – I don't know what that is. One of those critters. <laughs> It's not a penguin. What what critter is that? It's what it's not peng. It's not a kind of a penguin. I guess it's a penguin, right? Casey Roman gave booze to all the maintenance people in her RV park, in which she was wearing Christmas socks. I don't know. I've gotten to the point. I can take Casey in small doses. I don't know, man. <sighs> yeah, and then, whatever. I'm not going to judge anybody. That's cool. Someone's got a problem drinking and you're, hey, here's some booze. I don't know. Woke up another another brown Christmas in Phoenix. Merry Christmas. Well, yeah, you're not gonna, I don't think Phoenix, I don't is it Phoenix ever had a white Christmas? I don't know. Deb and the Desert Dogs, I'd 17B. My son wanted one of those huge, complicated uh, Levi, you I mean Lego sets, and I said no. Yeah, yeah. It's very complicated. There's little tiny pieces. And the, there's no wording in the directions. It's all pictures. Anyway, this is from Scott and Jen. Uh, we enjoy watching you. Maybe one day we'll be on your radar. Not really yet, though. Aww. Send me uh, send me uh, your uh, channel uh, link at camodavidgmx.com, and I will uh, put you on the list. Thank you, Scott and Jen, very much. And finally, the last card, Peace and Love with a uh, – Cardinal, I believe that's the state bird of Virginia, the Cardinal. Whoa, a long letter here from Bonnie Lynn, always watching. Wow. Oh, we, she, uh, she said uh, she likes to watch RV Rebel Girl. She is my favorite nomad. Oh, wow. Maybe in 2021 or 2022, you can actually do something in the real world. I hope to. <laughs> Get in the real world. <laughs> hey, thank you, Rick. Rick Petticord, uh, Nevada, right? He also said if I get out his way, I got a room for a, a, a rent-free room for a few nights. So, you know, I've got that. You know, uh, you know so I, maybe one of these days I will. I I do one of one of my trips I want to take in 2021 is get out to the Phoenix. Las Vegas area. I've been to Vegas many times, never driven there, but I've flown there many times, including uh, Stormy's little birthday celebration uh, last year. It's the last year, no, 20, no, it was, yeah, last year, 2019, yeah, for the acquisition of fig, figgy pudding. RV Rebel Girls drives around, cooks gloppy food, and looks for a shower. She does, but she does travel, John, you know, yeah, you know, but she is constantly on the road doing things. A lot of these nomads right now, even this year with all the stuff going on, she traveled. Where did she go? She went down to Texas. She shopped to Michigan. She went out to Arizona. She's driven. She's been, you know, you got to hand it to her. She's She's been on the road a lot. 
you know, and a lot of people are just, oh, you got to buy a house and hunker down and buy a lot of pinball machines. <laughs> I don't understand these YouTube channels that I have to do something in one minute. And it's a yeah, I go, yeah, or not a 10 minute. I love these YouTubers that are basically not doing much and it's, they have to do it in 33 minutes. You know, I'm going to drive around and go to the Walmart and cook up some gloppy food. And it's a 35 minute video. I'm like, Ugh. don't they realize we're watching other YouTubers? You know, I mean, you know, I, you know, you know, that would be a, a six minute video. You know, if it's six, make it a six minute video. I don't know. Casey Roman only gave little bottles of booze. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's nice. That's nice. I got a big bottle. <laughs> Tito's vodka. Thank you, Mr. Rod Sturgis, one of our favorite. The official, the official Camo Dave troll, Rod Sturgis. <laughs> and again, uh, I want to thank Rod for this wonderful uh, lamination here. Barb took the picture back in 2019. We did a we did a uh, Christmas card last year that Barb put together. It was really nice. And then I went through one of the pictures this year and I got this one. So, uh, so yeah, so uh, this is really nice. So uh, thank you so much, everybody. This was a, just turned out really nice. Dave and Crotchy. And, of course, the uh, Lifetime Achievement Award for the best puppet on YouTube, at least the bottom of YouTube, is Mr. Crotchy. I want to thank everybody for a wonderful year. Yes, and I want to thank Dave for all the cheap vodka. Yeah, and uh, we, you know, yeah, yeah. I hope Dave does some traveling, and he's going to take me with him. So if he goes to Arizona later in 2021, I've got to go and get to see everybody. You know what I want? My wish is I want I want to see Seymour. I wish um, that guy up in Harrisburg would mail Seymour down here so I could hang out with Seymour and show him some of the wonderful scenery here in the uh, beautiful Western North Carolina. Seymour. Yeah, Seymour, uh, uh, Mr. Brunger made Seymour and made me too, so we're brothers. Yeah, wouldn't that be nice? Crotchy and Seymour get together. Yeah, that would be nice. What a what a wonderful Christmas thought there. <laughs> well, I'm only going to go an hour this morning, okay? I know you've got some other plans today. Christmas is a busy day for a lot of you folks, and I don't want to take up too much of your time. But I did want to shout out. Uh, I thought I want to do a I want to do a little show this morning, showing everybody all the wonderful cards I got, and, and you know I'm, I'm sure more are still coming because the mail has been kind of messed up lately. But I want to thank you all, and uh, you know some of you guys threw some cash in with your cards, and I got a few a nice little uh, swag, a, few, a little bit of swag in there too. So thank you so much. Uh, yeah, and uh, of course the. Uh, I believe odd 17B, odd 17B, I think, Tasmod, I, I, I'm getting all forgot, forgetful. The Camo Dave News Army, if you want one of these, just send me an email, camodave at gmx.com, put me here, give me your address and I'll mail one of these to you. We do have about four or five of these left, so if you know, if you, you know, if you send me an email, I'll pop one of these in the mail to you too, but we only got a couple of these left, so anyway. 30 on a wake up seems he's doing a three hour live chat every day. Yeah. I don't know. You know, I do love, I, I really love Rosie O'Kelly a lot, but I, I can't, you know, there's so many of those IRL people. They just, it's just too much. It's too much. Hot butter rum, hot butter rum. Mm. <clears throat> My parents were big into eggnog, you know, spite, you know, with the, with the rum in it. That's what you do. You know, Christmas Eve, what we would, what they would do in a normal Christmas, and we didn't have too many normal Christmases, was uh, Dad would put on the Christmas music, and the, we'd sit at the tree, and then we'd go to a Christmas evening that, you know, Presbyterian. My parents were pretty big Presbyterians, although, you know, toward their later part of their life, they kind of gave up on that. But uh, they, you know, back when we were kids, they went to church a lot, Presbyterian church, right, you know, and, uh, <clears throat> We would go to the evening service at the church, sometimes 10 o'clock, some, not usually the midnight one, but usually like an evening service. And then we'd come back and then we'd all have eggnog and some cookies, Christmas cookies and eggnog. And and then even when I was a kid, dad would put some rum in it, you know, and uh, and then we go to a bed and the, the Santa would come and then we'd wake up about six or seven in the morning and open the presents. So, yeah. I love Rosie O'Kelly. Happy Merry Christmas to Rosie. I sent Rosie one of these. 
So uh, she should be getting one of those in her mailbox very soon, if not already. Wild turkey. <laughs> I don't know, man. Oh, thank you, Shemay. I want, again, I want to thank my mods this year, especially, especially Shemay, Noreen, and the Doxy. I think Doxy's, I'm sure Doxy's probably still sleeping. He probably didn't get up till nine or 10. But I want to thank everybody. It's good that he isn't here because he'd be like, what are you doing at live stream on Christmas morning? Ah, what do you think? Who do you think you are? <laughs> but I did, Doxy, if you're watching this, I did shout out your uh, Christmas card there. Thank you very much. And hopefully we can get together a little more often in 2021, okay? But, I, you know, I, I've offered to go over there. I say, hey, I can come over and we can do – a live chat and, you know, hang out in the doll room and hang out with Jilly. And it, he just kind of, I, I get it. Mom was a Baptist. My, my mom and dad were, they were, when they, they went to church a lot. And then dad, I think got, mom and dad got kind of like, I don't know. They just kind of organized religion. They got kind of down on it. And then it gets to the point where you only go on Easter and Christmas, you know, <laughs> Easter and Christmas, the rest of the year, you know, and then it wasn't even that. So I don't know. <laughs> crane operator merry christmas again merry christmas to everybody i don't want to stay on here too long this morning go open your presents go have a nice uh christmas uh, we'll be back tomorrow oh god tomorrow we'll be doing saturday with the normal 9 30 a.m and uh, 11 a.m times or 11 p what is it 9 30 a.m and 7 p.m so we'll be doing our regular uh, live chats tomorrow so but I just wanted to do a little one this morning because it was easier to show the cards and uh, rather than me filming segments and putting that all up, I thought I wanted to do a little Christmas card show this morning. So that's that. That is that. All right, everybody. Thank you so much. 2000 ta Talon, Mary Critton. And anyway, again, I want to thank out. I want to thank my mods, especially to Shemay, Noreen and the Doxy, the, the, you know, what do you say? They've been done a, done a stellar job. All right. And, and I want to, and I want to especially shout out to Shimei. She bought a van. She bought a van. So uh, we, I hope uh, she gets out on the road pretty soon. She has to wait for the New Jersey department of motor vehicles to send her like her plates, which may be a while, but when she gets that and she gets some, a little bit of fixing up done on it, she's going to be heading out to the grand Canyon. So all the best to her. No fear to track. Nice to see you here this morning. Sorry it's so early. Although you are what? You're probably in Tennessee, right? Yeah, that's right. Uh, yeah, I am not. Ten, no fear to track. I am here in uh, in the Morganton area through Christmas. So yeah, let's get together for lunch uh, on like on New Year's Eve when you get your uh, or hopefully your uh, your your RV will be fixed up there in Asheville. Come back, come in here, and we'll do lunch on you. <laughs> so I will. You're in Kentucky, right? Yeah, yeah. He he was here about a month ago, and we had a nice chat. And then he took his van or his RV and drove it to uh, Asheville, where he has to have it serviced. And he's got like four wheel drive put on it. And then he took a plane to uh, to Nashville, and then he got a ride up to, to Kentucky, where he is now. So he's going to reverse that. And then, so hopefully he'll have his vehicle by New Year's ish, and, uh, and well, he said he'll swing by here. And we'll have another little powwow, so that'll be nice. And we'll wear our masks. Everybody was upset because we, I did the little tour of his vehicle there without my mask on. But uh, you know, anyway, Shemay has a plan and a van. That's right. John Sweet, nice to see you, John. I'll be chatting with you later on the phone later today. I'm sure. I'll, I'll give some I'll give some people some Christmas calls today, and John is on the list. <laughs> Fingers and trove. Yeah, that's right. Hopefully it'll be done. Right. Well, I don't know. I guess you could come by in January if you know you got to wait for it, right? If it's not done, what are you going to do? You can't go anywhere. You, you'll rent a car, I guess. He wants to go. Uh, uh, no fear to truck. Wants to get out to Arizona. You know, the RTR technically always took place like the second week of January, so a lot of people are going to be out there for. You know, even though they don't have an official RTR this year, they still want to get out there and do their big meetup. So a lot of folks are going to be heading out. Even more. We already got a gazillion folks in court site and even more are coming in early 2021. So anyway. All right, folks. Thank you so much for watching. I do appreciate it. Merry Christmas to everybody. 
Uh, thank you so much for all your cards and uh, kind wishes, and I appreciate that so much. And uh, hopefully 2021 will be a lot better year than 2020 was, okay? Yeah, Merry Christmas to all the chatmonger friends. Merry Christmas to all our Canadian buddies. You guys, I, you know, you celebrate Christmas on the same day, right? I don't know. Chris Cannon always does it. Thanksgiving is like October something, and like you, but everybody celebrates Christmas on the twenty fifth, right? I no Canada. We celebrated on. We already celebrated it on November sixth. Sarah Cox, Albuquerque, New Mexico. Merry Christmas to you in her tiny house. Aww. <clears throat> All you nomads who are alone this for Christmas today or whatever, I hope you all having a nice time. Hope we can put a little joy in your life with our little get together this morning. And uh, yeah, so just came out of a GMX car coming. I got a few more of these left, but only a few. And uh, of course, we got a whole pile of the uh, Camo Army cards. Thank you all for all your news tips. I appreciate it. Just came out of a GMX .com and I'll put those in the mail to you pronto. All right, folks, thank you so much. Merry Christmas to everybody. You all have a safe and sane holiday. Don't eat too much. Don't overeat. <laughs> I won't. Believe me. Oh, my uh, Walmart's turkey sub <laughs> and some chips. I want to thank, uh, again, Rod Stern just for the, the booze. And he sent me a whole big box of those little bags of chips. So I got a lot of booze and, and chips. So uh, <clears throat> And a turkey sub. <coughs> yes, Christmas is this. Yes, I think so. Yeah, pretty much the same. And then the Brits have their Boxing Day, right? Where they, I think Boxing Day is where they open up the presents, right? Boxing Day isn't a big thing here. St. Nick's Day. Oh, on the, on the 6th of December. I did not know that. Yeah, the, they have the uh, Boxing Day there in a lot of the British countries and Brit, British Empire. So, uh, but yeah, here in America, we don't, what's boxing? We just do it all on Christmas. All right, everybody. Thank you so much for watching. I do appreciate it. You all have a wonderful rest. Yeah, booze and chips. <laughs> I'm crotchy. Crotchy here, crotchy. Oh, thank you, Nate. All right, everybody. Thank you so much. Uh, we made it through 2020. That's not a small achievement. Okay, we still got another week to go. But uh, anyway, I'll see you all tomorrow doing the live chats at 9.30 a.m. and 7 p.m. Eastern. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you to Brad and uh, Michael and Bella and Rick Pettacord for your kind super chats. I appreciate it. Thank everybody for their kind Christmas cards. I, I'll probably be getting a few more in the mail uh, in the next few days. So uh, I will do those shout outs. And I want to thank everybody for all your kind wishes this year. And you all have a wonderful rest of your Christmas and stay safe. And I'll talk to you later. All right. Thanks, everybody. Merry Christmas and ho, ho. Oh, oh, okay. Not yet. No, we don't want to We have one more thing we want to do. I almost forgot. This is dedicated to Mr. Stingray. Holiday troll. Holiday troll. There you go. Merry Christmas, everybody. <laughs> <laughs>